hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today i wanted to revisit something interesting the new show emulator so um, if you remember this one is a switch emulator based on the old yuzu project but here is the cool part new show actually supports android 10 even some other phones can still run it which is kind of crazy for a switch emulator and i've been getting a lot of questions about it so i decided to bring it back on the channel in this video i'll show you exactly where to get a new show emulator i mean the same version and i'll also walk you through on how to set it up on your android device without stressing so if you've been looking for a switch emulator that works on lower android versions or just want to try it out again then you are in the right place so without much ado let's get started Now, first of all, um, we have to download the emulator, I mean the latest version, I mean the APK. So, there is going to be a link under this video description. So, all what you have to do is just visit the link. Now, after visiting the link, you should see something like this. I mean, you, sh you should see a page like this, a Google Drive. So, um, all what you have to do is just press on this download icon over here this thing over here just press on it and then it should take you to another page which will ask you to download anyway so just press on download anyway so get the emulator here just press on download anyway so um, get the emulator after that there is going to be um, one more program that you will need so first of all open after downloading the emulator so um, after downloading the emulator open your google play store so um open your google play store and then search for z archiver search for this 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 file manager search for this file manager after that download it and and then open it so um, after getting or after downloading the emulator and also opening the file with the file manager you should see something like new shoe emulator blah 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 but here is the catch before you can play any switch games on mobile there is going to be i mean you you have to um, have a firmware and a product keys and i'm sorry to say this i can't teach you where to get the firmware and the product keys so um just do something about it so um after getting the firmware as you can see i have my firmware over here and also i have the p keys as my product keys over here now please remember um your firmware version have to be the same with the product with the same with your product keys so here i, I have firmware version 20 and so on meaning my product keys version have to be 20.5.0 so um get those those files and then you are ready to go so after getting the necessary requirements for the emulator all what you have to do is you have to extract the product keys first so you have to extract the product keys first to do that just press on it and then select the third one which is extract two names select this one and then your product key should extract into a folder so after that go ahead and install your new show emulator press on it press install so after you are done installing the app just open it and then it should greet you with a welcome page so from here just press on get started grant notification permission just press on allow here it says prod keys this uh, which simply means um you we will need to press on the select keys and then locate the folder that we extracted our p keys so to do that just press on select keys then visit the folder that contains your product case which is this one this one you select your product keys 
it says title keys do the same thing this time around just select title keys here it says select your games folder with the button below so um what this means is that after pressing this you locate the folder that contains your switch games files and then select that folder so press on add games select the folder that contains your switch games so i have my switch games inside the rom roms folder which is this one so um when you add the folder that contains your switch games just press on use this folder just press on this blue thing use this folder press allow now here press on or take in deep scan and press ok now press on continue so um with this you are done setting up the emulator and um you should be you know ready to play your switch games on your older android phone now this one um is for snapdragon users so let's say um you, you you your phone you have a custom gpu drivers for your device which is a snapdragon and you want to install the custom gpu drivers alongside with this emulator so that um you you have a performance in your in your games all what you have to do is press on the setting icon over here and then select on gpu driver manager which is this one so you select on select your gpu driver manager and then and then you press on this thing it is great but you press on this press on this thing which is down right corner over here you press on this and then select the folder that contains your custom gpu drivers so um i have my custom gpu drivers here which is um qualcomm snapdragon 849 this thing so this thing is my custom gpu drivers so um i'll select it and then it should start installing as you can see i have an iq phone so this is my custom gpu drivers so um after setting your custom gpu drivers and then maybe you tried game and then the game force close all your games are not working meaning the drivers is not compatible with your device so all what you have to do is you have to disable your install drivers and to do that just go to the settings go to the gpu driver manager and then you either press on delete or you set it on your system gpu driver which is this one so um after setting it then all your game should start working now so um thank you for watching this video if you really like my video please go ahead and subscribe to the channel because you subscribing to the channel really encourage me to do more video like this so go ahead and subscribe to my channel now see you next time